And I want you guys to label the right angle. So what I mean by that is... Fitting in is something that everyone has a hard time with, especially when you're growing up. When I was younger, like I, I wasn't into sports. I wasn't into um, stereotypical things that guys were into. But for Luis Sanchez, fitting in was the least of his problems because... When I was younger, I was bullied by other students. They would not want to sit by me. Um, I was called sissy. The name calling and bullying he experienced affected him deeply. It made me feel worthless. It made me feel like I didn't matter. One time in middle school, I did try to commit suicide. Uh, and one time in high school, I tried again. As he grew up, he thought the bullying was finally over. So I'm multiplying one by five. There was an incident at the school where students were writing things. Um, Mr. Sanchez is gay around my walls. Um, and uh, among other things, uh, among my outside walls. It made me feel like I was in elementary school again. It made me feel like somehow I didn't have control over it, even though I do, because I'm an adult. But this time, he was not alone. Mr. Sanchez did not deserve to be treated that way, and I think those kids should have some consequences. He had come to work every day for two months and, and saw that all over the walls outside his room. And it was um, you know, disheartening, just, just really, really upsetting to see a teacher getting bullied by his own students. At the start of each school year, all YNI intermediate students are given a Chapter 19 booklet that explains the rules governing student discipline and misconduct under state law. I went into each classroom and had a discussion with the kids about Chapter 19 all over again with the focus on bullying and how bullying isn't acceptable nor is it tolerated on the Waianae Intermediate School campus for any student or teacher. In spite of a few bad apples, there are students who look up to him. You can always go to him when you need someone to talk to, like even though it's not about school or math or anything. Like, if you want to talk to him about problems or anything, you can go to him. I think he's a really good teacher. I really like him a lot. He, no matter what he goes through at this school, he keeps trying, he doesn't give up. By not giving up, Sanchez has brought positive changes to the school. I actually had a meeting with the teachers, um, and there were several teachers that Mr. Sanchez was talking about the incidents that were happening in his classroom and so they actually came to have a meeting with me and gave me some contacts of people who could come in and educate both teachers and students about bullying in general. The changes made in school have allowed Luis Sanchez to move past the bullying and move towards forgiveness. I love all of my students and I understand that middle school is a really tough time but I guess the main thing I would want them to know is what that is uh, I forgive them. This is Lehalia Punui reporting from Waianae Intermediate School for Hikino.